The field of Tannenberg, near the Polish border in Prussia, July the 15th, 1410. Following the defeat of the Crusades in the Holy Land, the Teutonic Order of Knights sought to carve out its own sovereign state by seizing territory in Prussia, then launching crusades against the neighboring Poles and Lithuanians. Reeling from this onslaught, the Poles and Lithuanians settled their differences. Under the guidance of the new Polish king, Vladislav Jagiello, and his cousin, Grand Duke Vytortas of Lithuania, they formed an alliance and prepared to fight back. Ulrich von Jungimann, Grand Master of the Order, stands at the head of a powerful army of Knights of Christ and prepares for battle. His well-equipped and battle-hardened force includes both Teutonic Order and Crusader Knights. Heavy infantrymen, crossbowmen and cannons also make the Order Army a dangerous proposition. King Jagiello has summoned a huge allied army of Poles and Lithuanians who now march for the Order's headquarters in Marienburg. Amongst Jagiello's men are armored knights, the flower of Polish nobility, together with infantry and light cavalry from both Lithuania and the Golden Horde. Although the Allies outnumber their adversaries, the quality of the Order's troops and equipment means that the result of the approaching battle is no foregone conclusion. For King Jagiello, finding some way to weaken the Order army is imperative. But much grim and bloody work lies between the Allies and victory this day.